In today's Roundable, we have famous consultant Joseph Giuliano, Richard Marble, contributor to Lean News, Marie Roberts, CEO of ABC Company, and talking head John Russo. Thanks to all of you for being here. Now, Marie, what can you tell us about process capability? Well, our company measures process capability, I think. But I'm not sure how. Let me tell you, Marie. Process capability is a measure of how well you are meeting customer requirements. For example, your company might manufacture widgets of some sort. We can pick a critical dimension on these widgets and measure process capability. Interesting. What does it exactly check for? Well, I think I heard that process capability measures output per hour. Nope. Process capability looks at two things. First of all, using our example, it would look at how close our process mean or average is to the desired dimension. This measures how centered our process is. It also would look at the variability or spread of our process. The less spread out our data are the better. So, what we want is a narrow process that is centered. That's correct. What are some of the measures of process capability? Well, I know that CPK is reported at our company. Right, CPK is the most commonly used measure. For example, a CPK value of 1.33 or higher is considered very good. A value below 1 is very bad. What about sigma level? Well, sigma level is also a measure of how well we meet customer requirements. We are striving for Six Sigma, which would be a defect rate of 3.4 defect per million opportunities. We would love that. I've heard that many of our processes are at a Four Sigma level. That's not bad. That's generally considered average. You should get your employees trained in the concepts of Lean Six Sigma. Well, to learn more, I would recommend visiting EMS Consulting Group www.emsstrategies.com That's where I learned everything I know about this stuff. www.emsstrategies.com Well, there you have it folks. And now, for Network News, this is BJ Willingham signing off. Wait, BJ if I haven't had a chance to say much and I'm supposed to be a talking head. Well, there you have it. Thank you and good night.